In tonight's consumer alert, the IRS says it will start accepting income tax returns as early as January 29th. But if you want to wait, you have until April 17th to get yours in. Normally, April 15th is the final filing deadline, but it falls on a Sunday this year. And Monday, April 16th, is Emancipation Day, a legal holiday in Washington, D.C. The IRS expects to issue most refunds within 21 days of a return being filed. An E. coli outbreak is now being linked to leafy greens and romaine lettuce. The Centers for Disease Control and Prevention say that E. coli made 17 people across 13 states sick in late November and early December and that one person died. The CDC says the source of the infection is still not known, but signs are pointing to romaine lettuce and leafy greens. A similar strain caused an outbreak in Canada in early November through early December, with 41 people getting sick. The CDC says it is still investigating the outbreak. Many Bison fans are calling it a revenge game. Call it what you want. The NDSU football team is ready for another crack at James Madison after last year's semifinal loss. We've got a live report from Frisco later in sports. They've already been hit with the snow and the strong winds. Now the power outages, the winter storm that's blasting the East Coast. Later on Valley News Live at 10. This morning, temperatures in Fargo not quite as cold thanks to some clouds and snow, but it was brutal in Bidette. And clearing skies means we too will have brutal morning temperatures. Your forecast is next.